everybody, and welcome to the third episode of my WWE Universe mode and the first episode of Shotgun Saturday Night. And let's see what Shotgun Saturday Night has in store for us. From the looks of it, it doesn't have that much uh, good in store for us. We have the Great Kali versus Eddie Guerrero to start things off. So let's get right into this one. Entrance is off. And who are we going to be? We're probably going to end up being Eddie Guerrero. Uh, I mean, or I could make it. Yeah, you know, we're going to just have a normal match. Actually, we're going to have uh, Eddie Guerrero completely squash the Great Kali. That sounds like a good idea to me. Sounds like a pretty good idea to me. Now we gotta sit through these loading screens. These are never fun. Eddie Guerrero, here we go. Let's just completely squash Kali. Come here. Oh. Kind of missed on that one. Hit him in the arm, it looked like. Ooh. Maybe he's gonna completely destroy me. I'd hope not, though. I'd really hope not. There we go. Just put him in there. Let's do a move ourselves. Are we gonna do a tornado DDT? Thought he was gonna bounce off, I guess not. Do a little scent on. I don't know why I called that so late, but. Elbow to the head! Ooh, nice drop kick there. Great Kali! the hell I don't even know what I just did there I got a signature though I'd like to use this Kali what are you doing to me I'd like to use this fine screw you buddy Come on, frog splash. Here we go. I can't go right into a pin off of that. Are you kidding me? One, two. Oh, kick out. Kali has some fight in him. Oh, that boy. Oh, guys. Kali thinks he can still win this one. Oh, my God. Oh, my goodness. But I, I can pin off of that, but not the frog splash. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Screw you, WWE 13. Screw you. I can pin off of that, too. See, I can pin off of that. But not the frog splash. I mean, really? What's up with that? What's our signature again? Um... Hold up, there it is. Is it the three amigos? No. You know, do we, I think we're going to finish him off with the three amigos. we got to finish him off with the three amigos. We've already tried the frog splash. Oh, wait, he doesn't have the three amigos yet? Oh, I guess this was before the three amigos, so we just do... Looks like a brain buster there. Whatever. Great Kylie's done. One two three the man was busted open the man was just no one likes the great collie I mean come on do any of you actually like the great collie 
I don't know anyone who likes the Great Kali. Oh man, that's some good uh, vanilla cola. That stuff's amazing. Cold, refreshing. That new Jack? I think that's new Jack. I just saw new Jack in the crowd. Heat. Yeah, I just spotted new Jack in the crowd. It's the original gangster new Jack. I wish I had a new Jack on here. I just have him interfere in every match. Just yeah, just bring weapons and just kill everybody. Beth Phoenix versus Stephanie McMahon. Every show has had a Divas match in the second match so far. Is that like a thing or something? I don't know why, but yeah. Let's get into this one. You know what? I'm going to play as Stephanie. That's why I didn't make it a squash match. I could have made it the quick match and just had Beth Phoenix destroy Stephanie. But uh, I think we're actually going to have Stephanie win this one. I haven't really played as the Divas, so give me a chance to get used to Stephanie, I guess. Stephanie. Alright. Oh, no. What do you think you're doing, Stephanie? I mean, uh, Beth Phoenix. Ducking out of everything. It's not the way we taught you. Ow! What a backbreaker there. Screw you. Screw you, Beth. Just screw. Screw you. Screw your family. Screw everything. Oh, fuck. Jesus Christ, I can't gain control on this one. You son of a bitch. Better get in the ring. What are you doing? Beth. I don't know what the hell she was doing running around the whole ring like that. I've never seen that before. They usually run to the nearest side and get in. That was weird. Alright, come on. Jesus. What are we playing? Ring around the fucking Rosie or something? That was ring around the Rosie right there. going for some type of spear and she turned it right into that slam a power slam there or scoop slam whatever I think it was that was a power slam scoop slams when you scoop them up I suppose All right, let's try that one more time there we go finally we hit something yeah that's right I'm all cocky and confident now taunting her even though she was up. Shit. Guess I shouldn't have been so confident and cocky. This it just came to bite me in the ass now. There we go. That's what I'm talking about, Stephanie. Damn it, what are you doing? Beth Phoenix is pretty good at reversing it seems look at that right into that backbreaker there I don't appreciate all your reversing Beth I could do without it Damn it. There we go. Let's put her up top. Suplex? Yes. 
big superplex here. Ooh, this is a big superplex. Got a signature. What's our signature? Bitch slap! And our finisher is... Pedigree! Taken right out of the book of Triple H. It's done. One. No! Shit! Beth is resilient. She's resilient! I thought that one was over. Well, I'll be damned. Oh, I missed the elbow. Hey, I think I see New Jack. There's New Jack in the crowd again. Move it, ref. Move it, Beth. Right there. See him in the Cactus Jack shirt there? The little do-rag on. I don't know what New Jack's doing here, but... Right here. New Jack. Don't tell me that doesn't look like New Jack. That looks like New Jack. Why am I doing that move so much? I have it for more than one direction. That's why I'm doing it so much. Okay. At least now I know why I'm doing it so much. Not just me hitting the same direction. Stop running. God damn it. I should have seen that coming. Alright, let's see. We're going to do... Oh, I thought we were going to maybe do a different move finally, but I guess suppose that we're not. Because of the fucking Beth Phoenix. Fuck you. Fuck. Fuck you. There we go. Let's go for that elbow drop again. Mother fuck. This is really... Beth Phoenix is being a complete asshole in this match. This one should have been over like five minutes ago, but no, Beth Phoenix has to be a complete dick. Yeah. You deserve to get kicked right in the skull like that. Get your bitch ass out of here. Get your bitch ass out of here. Fuck, alright, get back in here. I got a signature. Oh shit, she has a signature. Face the bitch slap, you bitch! Fucking pedigree are here again. It's over. No fucking way Phoenix can kick out of two pedigrees and two bitch slaps. One, two, three. That's. Well, that was a boring match. But we won. That's all that counts. Doesn't look like there's going to be anything happening here. Cutscene wise. I'm that damn good. Sure, Stephanie. And you did just win your match against Beth Phoenix, so yeah, you're 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 okay. Hurricane versus Steiner. This is a no-brainer. Who's gonna win? Of course, it's gonna be Steiner. And a quick match, of course, too. I mean. It's fucking Steiner.
Scott Steiner. That's all I got to say about that. Scott fucking Steiner. Is it just me? Or are these loading screens just getting longer and longer? There we go. Oh, Scott Steiner's just gonna destroy you, Hurricane. Really? You're working on my arm? That's, what are you gonna do with that? I'm fucking St Scott Steiner. I'm Big Papa Pump, motherfucker. Think you're gonna be able to stop me with a little arm submission? Hell no. You wish you could be as good as me, Hurricane. You wish you could. No one can be as good on the mic as Scott Steiner. That's for sure. Military press drop. Big belly to belly. It's over. Hurricane is out of it already. I don't see him getting out of this one. One, two, three. It's done. Hurricane stood no chance against the big Papa Pump, Scott Steiner. Nobody stands a chance against big Papa Pump. Alright, there's not going to be anything happening there, so let's exit this and see what we have in store for us next. So I have no clue what's coming up next. Ooh, triple threat. Sheamus, Daniel Bryan, and Thumbtack Jack. This is continuing on from uh, SmackDown. If you haven't watched that yet, Daniel Bryan came out after the Sheamus Thumbtack uh, Jack match. He stood on the ramp after Thumbtack Jack won that one. Ooh, this one should be fun then. This one should be really fun. I think I'm gonna have to be the Dazzler. Yep, we're gonna play as the Dazzler in this one. This one might be a long match. And it's not even the main event. I think there's one more match after this. There's usually five matches on the card, I believe. I do believe so. There might not be. I could be completely mistaken, but I do believe there's usually five on a card. So... I'd expect this to be the main event. I wonder if the main event will blow this match. We'll just make this match look like nothing, because, I mean, that would be pretty cool. Yes, we got to play Daniel Bryan. Hey, look at the, the yes chance. Oh, there was yes chance for a short second there. Let's go after Thumbtack Jack. We came out on the ramp and pointed to him after his match, so I mean... We obviously wanted Thumbtack Jack for some reason. I don't know why we wanted Thumbtack Jack, but... Damn you, Seamus. I don't like you, Seamus. You're an arsehole. Actually, hold up. Is DQ on? DQ is off. Alright. Ow. God damn it. Let me get out of here. No. Ow. What are they doing? 
This isn't fair. I'm one man, you're two. This isn't fair! All right, sorry for that outburst. Okay, now what are we going to do? I got to even it up somehow. Shit, 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 shit. I was going to go for a suicide dive, but it didn't seem like uh, he wanted to do one. I want my chair back. Here. Fuck you, thumbtack. There we go. That's how you make a comeback. Both these guys have it out for me for some reason, though. I don't know why. God damn it, I wanted to whip him into the corner with Jack do one of those little fancy two people in the corner moves but that is not going to happen it seems let me pick up my chair at least van dazzinator the van dazzler there we go that's the van dazzler that we just did ow that probably hurt us a lot more than it would hurt thumbtack jack a lot more than it would hurt thumbtack jack that was a complete stupid spot that uh would hurt like hell oh ooh, I thought I was going into those stairs uh oh uh oh ooh ooh low blow by Daniel Bryan hmm okay Motherfucker. He's trying to get him out of the ring. No. No! 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 Match is not going my way. Grab the ring bell though, we got that now. That should be good. Slide it. No, don't throw it. Slide it. No, what are you doing, Daniel Bryan? Slide it in the ring. You stupid idiot. Stupid! Stupid! Fine. Ooh, that could look like that could have just broke Seamus' neck out of the glimpse I saw of that move. That looked a little kind of painful. Let's go up top. Elbow drop. Oh, we got signature. Come here, thumbtack. All right, let's hit Seamus with that famous yes lock. Yeah, we're not going to get it. We got the ropes, but it was worth the shot. No, I didn't want to pin him. I was trying to run into Jack and hit B so I could Irish whip him. Oh, you're going to do a bulldog? One. Oh, no, not even one. Got to make sure Seamus can't use his comeback. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, you son of a bitch. That could have completely screwed me over right there. Completely screwed me over. It didn't though. Luckily. Come here, Seamus. Let's give you the Van Dazzler. I like that name for that move, the Van Dazzler. Seamus is, he's busted open though, so. That's good. Ooh. 
Uh oh. Jack has his signature now. Uh, comeback now. Now I use my comeback too. Someone get in that corner. That's all I need. Jack, you want to get into a corner? No? Shit, you whipped me into the corner. Fuck. Well, I guess I won't be using my comeback. No, 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 no. Not these submissions. They're not that fun. I don't like them. You son of a bitch. Get off me. I don't agree to this. Here we go. That's what I wanted to do a while ago. Let's see if we can get this. Oh, we don't even get a one count off of that. Okay. Can't seem to hit any kicks in this match. Alright. We got Seamus now. Oh, I thought we had Seamus to ourselves for a couple of, for a minute or so. Ooh, right on that. I thought he hit that ring bell since it bounced, but I guess not. No, Jack, just no. You're not going to be getting him with any arm submissions. His arms, I don't think, are really that worked on in the first place. Yeah, fuck you, Seamus. Come here. Big elbow. We should be getting another signature soon. At least I'd like to believe so. Yeah, there it is. Here we go. Use it on Jack. And then get Seamus. Oh, you son of a bitch, what are you doing? Come here. Get you right out of that. Right into a yes lock. Oh, yes! 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 We got him. Oh, my. I thought Thumbtack Jack was going to break that one up. Yeah. Yes. Yes. We were busted open? I don't remember that happening. I honestly don't remember that happening. When did that happen? Hey, there's New Jack again. Are we going to see any more New Jack? That's like the fourth time we've seen New Jack so far. Well, that was a pretty fun match, I would say, if I could say so myself. Kurt Angle versus Christopher, which I'm assuming is Christopher Daniels. That it is. Uh, that's not the, the, the triple threat should have been the main event. Christopher Daniels versus Kurt Angle doesn't seem as good as a main event to me, but we'll play it anyway. Entrance is off. Normal match. Play. We're gonna play as Kurt Angle. Yeah, Kurt Angle. We're gonna play as Angle. I was expecting a better main event, but yet again, this is only Shotgun Saturday Night. And at the same time, a while back, actually just last week when I played, uh, I kind of had Dean Ambrose for Stone Cold in a last man standing match, already made up that way, as my main event on Shack, uh, Shotgun Saturday Night, so I mean, I don't know. I was expecting something bigger, I guess. Kurt Angle versus Christopher Daniels should would be a good match, but I mean, it is a good match, but I mean, come on. After that, you just want something bigger than Kurt versus Christopher. 
Old school Kurt, though. He has hair. Uh-oh. Ooh. <clears throat> God damn it. Can't get any offense in this one. A uh, little bit at the beginning, but... Now Christopher Daniels seems to have taken over the offense, but now I'm back. Taking over the offense. Oh, I didn't mean to turn him around. I accidentally hit this, uh, push the stick. Big drop kick. I was going to go for a strong Irish whip, but that, I guess, wasn't going to happen as Christopher Daniels is now making his comeback. Ow. Oh, big arm drag right off the top. Come here. Come here, you son of a bitch. Apparently that fan loves demons. That's kind of scary, if you ask me. But okay, he loves demons. At least it wasn't New Jack with that sign. Where is New Jack? Oh, there's New Jack, second row. Guess he just traded seats with a fan. Well, like he was just... I don't even... Oh, there's another New Jack. How many New Jacks is there? There's quite a few New Jacks. That's cool. Glad to see New Jack is filling up arenas. Come on, Christopher. What do you think you're doing? What do you think you're doing? Big drop kick right to the back. Oh, you son of a bitch. What's this? He looked like he was he struggled to pick up angle there a little bit, but okay. Oh, you son of a bitch. Oh, come on. I can't get like any offense here in this one. Which sucks. Ow, Daniels. Thought we were friends. There's another guy with a I Love Demons sign. I don't understand the relevance to this match in Demons, but okay. Someone possessed? Are, are anyone's eyes black? If someone's eyes are black, then they might be possessed. Well, then they are possessed, actually. Someone set a devil's trap somewhere. Gotta catch these damn demons. Frog splash. There we go. Triple Germans. You know what? I'm gonna put him through the damn announcer's booth. Come here, Daniels. I just wanna play a friendly game. Of go the fuck through that announcer's table. Angle slam. Surprised they didn't replay that. God damn it, you were supposed to get right into the ring. Well, now there's no way I can pin him off of it. Well, he was a little bit close, but I think that was supposed to be some type of shoulder tackle there. And he's getting out of this one. God damn you. I'll just get into the ropes. 
He has a signature though. So I gotta look out for those now. Signatures and his finishers and all that fun shit. That I'd rather not have to look out for. Here it comes. Is this his signature? That's not his signature. Yeah, that's not his signature. Oh, fuck. I'm screwed. Did I get out of that? Did I get out of the angel's wings? I did not get out of the angel's wings. God damn it. This one might be over. Do I have resiliency? Yes. This one isn't over yet, Daniels. I've still got some fight left in me. A little bit. A little bit. Right into that triple German. I think this one's over, guys. Let's move him away from there a little bit. Stand here. Let's call him up. Right into the angle slam. This is done. I don't see Christopher Daniels being able to kick out of this. One, two, three. It's over. Hey, look, New Jack. New Jack celebrating. New Jack, over here. <clears throat> I guess New Jack didn't want to wave. Oh, there's a cutscene. I like cutscenes. Is it a show of respect? It's a show of respect. Is it? Is it really, though? It really is. I didn't. I was expecting Christopher Daniels to, you know, turn around with a big clothesline to Kurt Angle and continue the feud, but uh, that's not the case. I am surprised about that one. Just a wee bit. And I think Christopher Daniels was heel, wasn't he? Which would mean, yes, Christopher Daniels has embraced the WWE fans, meaning. Christopher Daniels has now turned face. What does this mean for the SmackDown brand going into the future? Well, that we're going to have to find out next week here. And we're also going to find out what's going on on Raw. I don't know what's the, We don't really seem to have any many feuds. We still have, we only have a couple more shows. We only have three more uh, what is it? Two more, two more, three more shows until uh, Extreme Rules, and I don't even know what the matches are going to be going into this because it doesn't seem like there's any real feuds going on yet. But uh, hope you guys enjoyed this episode, the first edition of Shock on Saturday Night, and I will see you guys for Raw.